guys welcome to my channel gm zone all right we are now on open ears open ears have just uh, released a test net this test net is more like um something need to be tested before it's meaning between march to april let me just see april exactly the minute is going to be that's when the minute is going to be released so they they came up with their test nets which is very good and uh, this test net is all about how to train people when its minute is being released you understand so uh what you just need to do if you can come to their twitter or official page is not it's not a problem so what you just need to do you just click on the one of this post exactly this post exactly the one that is written exciting on the future of data blah blah, blah 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 so after you're done just click on it so after clicking, cl clicking on it is saying that launching the future open ears long test net of v, a new era of digital access trading so all of these you can read them later but all we are here to do i mean i mean the purpose of why we are here is because of the rcp and explorer you are do you understand so that's the reason why we are here so all you just have to do make sure that you have a metamax app you are going to use metamax be sure that you have a metamax app download download it from play store do i have it already it may show to you in a way whereby imports wallet um uh, import wallet or uh, import token and I import let me say it's going to show to you as import key phrase or create a new key phrase you understand so i have my own account already i don't need to create i don't need to import mine is there already but for you if you have it already and you've already created one keep it safe and if you have your own and you open in this manner then you are good so right now guys what we have to do is to add the open ears network you can either add manually but i, I won't advise you guys to add manually if you want to add manually you come right to this place to add it you click on add network you click on this add network and you click on the custom network you add the name which is open ears the rpc is here the rpc this is the rpc you can either you copy it you copy it you copy it copy link address you paste it here then you add the chain id the chain id is to 97798 then the symbol the symbol is oex then the block explorer explorer is here already is here is here too you just copy it this is the block explorer yeah you paste it here but i won't actually advise you much to do that you still have to stress yourself you just you just need to add automatically let not just add automatically let's add automatically we open a new page so after opening a new page let us we are going to use our faucet faucet has everything already faucet has not swapping the faucet this is a faucet this is a faucet it has everything already you copy it now we've copied it then all you just have to do is to paste it here so now we've pasted it here give it time to load then you connect your what your web theory is already connected now it's connected i've connected now just click on connect web theory wallet and after clicking on web theory wallet you click on claim testnet usdt here they are going to give you i think some amount of usdt there is need for gas fee from core they are going to deduct 0.001 of core from your balance make sure that you have at least 0.1 core on your balance so you click on confirm and they are going to send you uh what's it called usdt now they sent you usdt now transaction successful you close it now we are just going to add log test this log adding log test is just the one that we are trying to add manually the network of open ears just click on the add log test and it's going to add successfully you add your long test this is it you see exactly the way i've just explained it the display name the chain id network url current symbol blog explorer just click on confirm 
now switch we switch the network now we've added the log test you connect the web through back switch connected so now we've added the long test you see that it's now added now this is it it's not added and our usdt is supposed to be reflecting now you you if you guys understand what we did here i did something i connect our 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 wallet i mean our network we connected i connected the um this one address of this metamax to this uh to engage with the core i have so i switch it to that you know if i want to claim another one again they will ask for another gas fee let me just claim again you guys will understand what i'm trying to say they've already given us what ten dollar there we already see what ten sorry let me go back open yes we see that they gave us already 10 usdt we've added our open es network now so now they gave us 10 usdt now we are trying to assess another 10 dollar again to be added again now which they will likely uh deduct 0 0.001 core mm, to give us what 10 usdt It's a token. Sorry, sorry. I think I've made him. I'm supposed to change it to call. Sorry. So now it's now on call now. So they, they can claim token, claim testnet. So right now they've showed us now. Um, now I'm about to claim to get another 10 USDT. I guess because the one we did before was. 0.001 core yeah exactly just like that and they gave us um they gave us just 10 usdt so right now we want to try and do it again um see the details and everything still loading self this can be quite challenging and frustrating guys but it just can only take it takes time it takes time let's try it again all right all right estimated gas fee total 0 0.001 so now we confirm again and they are going to detect 0 0.001 just like the way we did it and they, that they give us 10 usdt now we're going to confirm it again then see what next transaction submitted waiting for confirmation your token claim was successful successfully submitted please wait about 10 block for confirmation okay good now it's been successful transaction successful tab to view this transaction so right now let's quickly go and check you will see we, we are supposed to have more than 10 usdt now i think i guess wow it's still 10 usdt well we we not miss waste much of our time um i think we just have to go to um what's it called um let's connect this first we just have to go to testnet swap you click on testnet what swap So after clicking on testnet swap we have at least let me say we have um you know it's with that to prone just go to metamax back and copy it there i mean paste it there sorry you paste it there you now when you click on that testnet swap it will direct it to other browser but just you all you just need to do you just copy that link and paste it here on metamax so we just have to give it time to load all right now we are here they said switch network in wallet so we switch, switch it to open yes great all right now we switch the network to open yes now it's connected it's not connected wow 
the 10 USDT is now added. We can see that we have 20 USDT now. But right now, I think if this is actually giving you a problem, or oh, I think I'll just, I'll just suggest you just like the way we came from, um, like the way uh, it is set from the official Twitter page of opening here, just click on the first of uh, this thing that is written exactly to unveil the future of digital asset trading with the launch of opening years so just click on this everything is there the link are there already all you just have to do is just to copy and go to metamax and paste it there so right now we just move down or we just want to, you just want to swap you just want to swap so the link to swap this is the link to swap copy link address you go to metamax straight away so we paste it here Oh, if you have gas fee, you can be able to swap very well easily on this opening X testnet. For those of you that have, even even though you have just zero, it's zero point one is enough for you to keep claiming USDT. They will just keep giving you with just zero point zero zero uh zero point zero zero one core. You will just keep claiming. You just have at least zero point one on your uh, on your wallet address. Okay, make sure that you've connected your wallet. Good. Now we have balance of twenty dollar. You know, all we are trying to do here, we are trying to claim um to claim testnet USDT, and they were charging uh deducting zero point one, zero point zero point zero one of my core. Yes. So we just go back no and you guys know how we did that we did that through faucet faucet link and the faucet link is on is here already all you just have to do is to copy it and paste it there to this is the faucet link it can help you to add the to to give you the link to your your swap to explorer to the block explorer to the to claim USDT. I think those are the first and also to add your long and also to add your open ES network. So right we, we are already done with that. So let us go to swap. We now now you have just balance of 20 USDT. Now with the balance of 20 USDT that we have, what how, how much can we use those 20 USDT to buy that can give us open ES? Let me just put the 20, which is the total amount of money that is available on my uh accounts on the wallet address so right now let me see 20 USDT that we have can only get us what 13.9 oes then what you just have to do is just for you to do right now currently the price of one only oes is the price of one oes is 1.433 but please mind you this is just test nets it is test nets they've already written it the test name means to test run something to test something in the fact that this thing that you're about to launch with mainnet let us test it let us engage people on how they are they can be able to have the little knowledge about it even for the newbies especially the beginners so this is just testing they are just test running their utilities or that is going to be used against the opening years when the minute comes you understand this is our door's testnet you understand okay let us ask for them they said presently one old es is around 1.4 usdt one oes is around 1.4 usdt so now with just 20 dollar we are getting just with just 20 dollars we are getting just 30.9 oes so we just click on swap can you see that you click on swap now we are swapping on so once you click on swap you click on confirm and after we click on confirm then we are good to go oh he says there's a something here meaning i can't just convert the whole amount of usdt said you need 0 0.00 one three eight more USDT to complete this transaction. Meaning that I need to, I mean, to remain some amount of money. I can't just convert everything at once. So let me remain. Let me just convert our USDT of 
18 years 18 to oh yes that, that means it will give us 12.5 then you swap then click on confirm then it will go so you just need to hold on give it some time let this load because if you don't give time to load because it would also still take time when you click on confirm just let this thing all of these loads like i mean this let it load now it's being loaded now so what you just need to do is to confirm now transaction submitted add oes to wallets so that is all then you close it not now we've already had the oes lawyer but if it's insisting on telling you that you have to add oes to wallet you add but let us cancel it for you first now we've done the transaction you close it up let us go back we will see that it's already reflecting yes this is it there's no need of you adding oes again because if, even though you add it doesn't really mean anything this is it we've converted the about 18 USDT down to open to get 12.4 oes which is good but if you want to if you are seeing the system of adding you, know, you just click on this you click on metamax here this sign of the logo of metamax you click on add it doesn't really matter it doesn't really change anything so you just add it doesn't and uh, you, you can say that once immediately we add it in the um the oes it change in logo that the logo change so guys in everything i've just been saying everything that we just be seen to get the link to this swap is here is here this is the link to the swap is here this is the link to the swap to get to the link to to the block is also here to the rpc is here and this is the file set this file set has everything it has the swap it has the block and it also has the um the open es network he has everything here the file set itself and also if you want to claim your identity is from this file set url so where do we even get this all this link is from the official page twitter page of open es you just go to your twitter and you just search for open ES. i'm just going to bring you this exactly so just note that that this is how you can just be able to to do everything and go through everything uh, to get your rpc link to get your swap link to get your block explorer link and also faucet everything is here and even though you click on the faucet which i've already explained when you connect your web3 wallet it's going to show you um how you can be able to add or to claim or to add your blog explorer and stuff and all and that so that's how to do it guys thank you and thanks for watching my video bye